I have Nikki and I'm going to show you a trip around about six feet under deep end dive that you've never seen before. I've been practicing. <laughs> <laughs> filmed in a while because summer has just been so hectic but I think I'm gonna make a video of my life today we're back to the vlogs so today we're gonna be going to the river and swimming and catching crayfish you don't know what crayfish are they're this really cool crustacean that are usually found in freshwater rivers and they are kind of like a prawn mixed with a lobster and I'm gonna show you the process of how we catch them and it's gonna be really cool it's way too hot got the dogs in the car I've got my swim shirt on <laughs> And we're just waiting for Devin, but he's taking forever. It's too hot, Lola. I'm just ripping down the trail just to go check if there's any dogs. And if not, I'm gonna let my guys off leash. This is our little secret spot. Oh, look, a piece of salmon. <laughs> we're in the right place. There's lots of eagles around here, I find. Welcome to paradise. With lots of stumps. So I'm just gonna run across here and check that island to see if there's anyone there. If not, we're in the clear. It's clear to me, I'm just going to get the dogs and then we're gonna carry everything over to our spot and start crayfishing. <laughs> Good boy! You're okay! <laughs> Are you panic swimming? It's okay! <laughs> yeah, he's gonna have to swim it. Ow! <laughs> Yeah, this is pretty deep for him, babe. It's only right here. He's like, hell no. <laughs> Devin, look at Jake. <laughs> I've never seen him go in the water voluntarily. This is so exciting. Wow. He doesn't know what to do with his tail. <laughs> wow! Good swimming! Lala. Are you okay, Boo Boo? Good boy! <laughs> There's actually two ways to catch crayfish. We're gonna do some in this trap and then we're gonna catch some by hand. Both we will demonstrate. Devin's hacking away at this turkey. So we have a whole chicken, some chicken legs, some salmon skin, and some tuna. Cat food. We got a shrieking dog. I think we're ready. Are you done? Can't take him anywhere. He just shrieks at everything. What are you doing, Lola? Just walks right over top of them. <laughs> so he's just headed over there where there's a deeper hole and he's gonna drop the prawn trap. I'm staying here so the dogs don't bark because they're already interested in where he's going. <laughs> You gotta help her. Come, come. <laughs> <laughs> come here, Luna. <Lola. laughs> Just jump in the water. Okay, so when you catch crayfish by hand, it, you gotta wear gloves because they pinch you. So I'm gonna dive down 
We have a beef patty in there and they're eating it and I'm just gonna whoop, get them. So, wish me luck. We're going in. Oh, it's gone. It's fucking hard pressure under there. Just grab the beef patty and throw it shallower if you want. They dragged it under a rock. <laughs> and they're like, where do you think you take this yeah, army? Like, Fuck you, man. Okay, hang on. Uh. Got one. Right on. I want to get a close up of it. A little small, we'll probably throw this one back. Yeah, I'll show it. I'll throw it back. I just want to show them what it looks like. It's like out of the water. Oh, okay, I need to like sit down. So they can breathe out of water. So I'm not hurting it right now. Well, I am holding it kind of tightly, but they got little pinches. Oh, this is slippery. Okay. Okay. So. He's sliding down that wall. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so he's like, I'm gonna fuck you up. But when you kill it, you eat the claws, which are kind of small. You want a bigger one. So you rip the claws off once you cook it. Rip the head off, and then the only part you really eat are the claws and this little tail piece. So you want it to be quite a bit bigger than this, otherwise it's not really worth the trouble. Look at him, he's like, I surrender! <laughs> Let's throw him back and let him get bigger. Watch him go in. He's like, I'm gonna go tell my friends you were mean to me. See you later, motherfucker! <laughs> Alright, you have to get up. I'm gonna show you a trip around about six feet under deep end dive that you've never seen before. I haven't practiced it. <laughs> <laughs> Ready to go home? Buddy. Hi. Okay, so it's day two. We left the trap overnight. We're going back to get it. I'm a little bit irritable because it's cold. It looks like it's gonna rain. Devin's wearing a wetsuit. Water's not as cold as I thought it would be. It's actually kind of nice. Devin probably didn't even need that wetsuit. It's dead here. No one's here. Probably because it's cloudy as heck. There's eagles circling because we have a little dog. We gotta keep him on leash because I keep seeing them like sail down and duck over us. Last time. No, those are too small. So we left the trap down at the river for another day because it had a whole chicken in it still. And a bear got into it, pulled it onto shore and just ripped this trap to shreds. So I guess that's the end of the crayfishing with the trap. I'll have to do it by hand now. Whoa, uh, buddy, what's in here? <laughs> no, no, they're gonna get pinched. There you. Have you picked one up and shown Lola what it is yet? Lola, what's this? Ooh. I wanna see her reaction. Zah. Oh, don't try to eat it. <laughs> She's trying to eat it. Like, what is that? Fishy. They're so confused. So Lola wants to try and get one. Right She's trying to get one. She's going to get one. <laughs> <laughs> she got one. But she got one. Oh, no. Get it out. No, 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 I want you getting pinched in the nose. <laughs> If you have caught crayfish from the river, I highly recommend soaking them in salt water for a couple of hours before you eat them because, and this is while they're alive, because they will spit out any mud that they've eaten and it just makes the meat a little bit more, like, clean. Like and subscribe. Or don't. It's your life. <laughs>